Pure Love, it's a new addition to the line of the Marie Sharp's world-famous pepper sauces. The pure pineapple pulp-based habanero pepper sauce adds another notch of flavorful heat to the well-known brand. This new pepper sauce, available in 5-ounce bottles, hits the local and international market on Friday. But this pepper sauce will do more than just satisfy your taste buds. The money from every bottle of this pepper sauce sold will be used to help victims of gender-based violence. It's a sauce that Marie Sharp says she's been holding on to for just this special moment. It was a formula that I had for some time, but I didn't market it. And uh, when Natella came up with the idea of, you know, this gender-based violence and what we could do to help, uh, it went into my mind, you know, that we could use this and make a go of it. So, you know, I, it, since I wasn't using it, I just created it then and, and uh, put it for the gen based violence. It's a pure pineapple pulp and, uh, and a banero pepper. We're using the yellow banero at the moment, but um, I think I'm going to have to make a switch because uh, the yellow banero is getting very scarce and uh, um, I might have to change and put some red in it. But um, the, 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 the formula is the same as the one I invented years ago and didn't market, I market it for... I know that Belize is not the only country with the problem. And, and the, the Germans made it clear when they came and they saw the label on my desk. They said, well, it's a problem that they also have, so it's something that they could, they could use, you know? So I know that it's not only Belize that suffers from this, it's worldwide. So I know that this label can, can really go. The monies will go to the Haven House, which is a not-for-profit organization that offers a safe space for women and children who've left abusive homes. Haven House has been in existence since 1993, and these monies will be used to provide transitional living opportunities as well as intervention services such as counseling, court advocacy, and referrals to women survivors of domestic violence. Haven House has provided emergency accommodation services to over 1,300 women and their children. Haven House adult residents have ranged from the age of 18 to 60 years old. And these child residents have ranged in ages from three days old to 17 years old. The shelter works by referrals, either via the police department, the domestic violence unit of that department, or the women's department. In order to access the services of the shelter, the women experiencing repeated incidents of domestic violence seek a safe place to escape along with their children. Every year, the U.S. Embassy in Belize carries out a series of activities to raise awareness on gender-based violence in an effort to stem this violation of human rights. And since last year, they set the groundwork to partner with Marie Sharps because they wanted to reach as many homes to spread the message that gender-based violence must end. And until that happens, we will see the benefits it will bring to homes, communities, and the wider Belize. It's no secret that societies that empower women to participate fully in civic and economic life are more prosperous and peaceful. Ending violence can ensure women unlock their potential as leaders, entrepreneurs, and innovators. The United States is committed to advancing gender equality and to preventing and responding to all forms of violence against women and girls. All around the world, we have seen how even modest investments in the abilities and potential of women and girls can yield transformative results, not just for them, but for their entire families and communities. Reporting for News 5, I'm Andrea Polanco.